Hi, my name is Megan, and today's workout is going to be a pyramid style workout. We're going to take two exercises. We're going to do each exercise for a certain amount of time. We're going to work our way up and then back down in time. So we're going to start out with each exercise 10 seconds, then we're going to do each exercise 20 seconds, then each exercise 30 seconds, then up to 40 seconds, then we'll work our way back down 30 seconds, 20 seconds, 10 seconds for each exercise. So the first two exercises are butt kicks, which is just a jog in place, and wall sits. So make sure you have a wall nearby that you can sit on or up next to. Make sure you're kind of warmed up before you start into these exercises. The butt kicks will get you nice and warmed up too, but make sure you've done a little bit of stretching um, exercises that aren't holding a stretch stationary, but, but just kind of moving your body around, get everything kind of warmed up and loose. Um, do that a little bit or even you know go for a little jog around your room for a minute or two or something just to kind of get that heart rate up and get the blood rushing through the body ready to start working out okay so if you've done that we're ready to start and I'm gonna watch my clock on this uh, for each exercise so we'll start um, with just 10 seconds each exercise work our way up and then back down you get it I'll keep track of the time, you just do what I say. So we're starting with 10 seconds of butt kicks. Ready, and go. 10 seconds here. Put those heels up to the butt. You can pump the arms here. If you want more, pump those arms up here, okay? And that's it, 10 seconds. Stop, go to your wall. 10 seconds here, wall sits. You're gonna want your quads to be parallel to the floor, knees, Ankles under the knees as much as possible. Pull the abs in tight and hold this wall sit. 10 seconds. Go. Hold this here. If you want, you can bring the arms over the head. Keep that heart rate up a little bit. Hold here and stop. Bring it back up. 20 seconds. Butt kicks. Go. 20 seconds here. Kick the butt. If you want low, this is low. You don't have to bounce. Keep moving. Keep pushing. And stop to the wall. 20 seconds. Wall sits here. And go. 20 seconds. Try to keep those quads parallel to the floor. If this is too hard for you, come up a little bit. Sit here. If you really want to get that good workout, push your back in flat, hold everything up high and tight. Hold it here. Belly button in, and stop. Back up. Butt kicks here. 30 seconds, go. Keep everything tall, strong, hop up with these. Really pump the arms, get the heart rate up. We got 30 seconds here. Keep going. And stop. Back to the wall. 30 seconds. Wall sits. And down. And start. Right here. 30 seconds. You can bring those arms up over the head here. You can raise them up and down during the wall sit. Or you can support yourself here on the quads. Try not to hold on to those knees. Support yourself here. Everything pulled in real tight. Abs in, back flat. Head up, chin up. All the weights in those heels. Keep breathing. And stop. Back up. This is the top of the pyramid. 40 seconds. Butt kicks here. Right here, 40 seconds. This is the longest part, and then we'll work our way back down and start taking time off. Really kick the butt, push the arms. Remember, if you 
knee low, stay here. If not, hop it up. Pump those arms up if you really want to work harder. Hands up to the wall. 40 seconds. Wall sits here. Ready and go. Hold here, wall sits. Pull the back in, push it flat to the wall. Pull your belly button in, rib cage held together tight. Remember to bring those arms up if you want to keep that heart rate up a little higher. Elbows need to stay above the heart. Try to keep those ankles right under the knees, perpendicular. Get low so the quads are parallel if you can. If not, just work as much as you can. Take a break if you need to. Come back down when you can. We got 10 more seconds here. Three, two, and up. Good job. Back to those butt kicks. 30 seconds here. Butt kicks. We pump those arms up if you want extra cardio. The heart rate up a little higher. Now just pump the arms here. Keep going, keep going. Hands up to the wall. 30 seconds. Wall sits here. And go. 30 seconds. Hold this in tight. Keep low. Toes and knees forward. All the weights in the heels. Head up, chin up. Keep breathing. Push your back against the wall. 10 more seconds here. Keep pushing. And stop. Back up. Butt kicks. 20 seconds right here. Go. 20 seconds. Pump those arms up. Make it harder. Really jump up, 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 up. And stop. Back to the wall. 20 seconds wall sits. And go. 20 seconds here. 20. And stop. Back up. Last 10 seconds butt kicks here. Ready, go. Last 10 seconds. Work hard. Pump those arms up or curl them here. Really bring the heels up to the glutes. And stop. Back to the wall. Last 10 seconds here. Wall sits. And go. Hold. Hold here. 10 seconds. Pull those abs in. Hold everything tight and strong. And stop. And bring it up. Good job. That was round one. Three more rounds to go in this exercise. You can do it. Grab a quick drink, towel off. You get one minute or less, a little break, then come back and join me. Ready, go. All right, we're ready for round two on this workout. Round two is going to consist of lunge jumps and then down to the mat or down to the ground for elbow, elbow, hand, hand. If you've worked out with me before, you know what those are. If you haven't, I'll explain them. So lunge jumps will be done up here, standing. You're in a lunge position. You're gonna pulse once and then switch legs in the air. Pulse once again, switch in the air. Pulse, switch, pulse, switch, okay? If you can't jump, just lunge back and pulse. You can do that too. Big arms up to help get that heart rate up. We'll move down to the floor. Now, elbow, hand, hand, sometimes tends to, if you're on a hard 
hard carpet. It's going to give me kind of a burn on my elbows. So I like to have a mat underneath me. You can use a t-shirt, sweatshirt, you know, whatever you want on the ground just to make it a little bit softer for you. It's up to you. But elbow, hand, hand's going to start in a plank position. Elbow, elbow, and then you're going to push up, hand, hand. Then you'll switch your lead arm. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand. If you want, you can do these on the knees. Just bring those heels up. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand. Okay? So we're going to do the same thing as we did before. 10 seconds to 40 seconds, back to 10. Starting 10 seconds, lunge jumps here. Ready? And go. 10 seconds, lunge jumps. Pulse in between. Pop up and switch. Big arm, scissor. And stop. Down to the mat. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand. 10 seconds. Ready, go. Keep everything straight, body straight. Head in alignment with the spine. And stop. Bring it back up. Lunge jumps here, 20 seconds. Ready, go. Exhale as you jump up. Scissor those arms big. Keep those heels down as you lunge. Keep going. And stop. Down to the floor. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand here. 20 seconds. And go. Elbow, elbow. Hand, hand, switch sides, elbow, elbow, hand, hand. Remember, if you need to do them on your knees, you can. Same thing, keep everything straight and strong. Keep it going. Exhale as you push up. Exhale here. And stop. Bring it back up. Lunge jumps here. 30 seconds, go. Keep your head up, chin up, real tall. Bend those knees in that lunge. The bigger your lunge is, the harder it's gonna be. Make it a little easier. Just do a split with the legs. Big scissor arms, gets that heart rate up even higher. And stop, back to the floor. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand here. 30 seconds, go. Now, if you can't do the elbow, elbow, hand, hand, hold this plank here, or even just hold here, that's fine. If you can do the elbow, elbow, hand, hand, that's great. If you can just do a couple, that's great. I know they're hard, but just keep trying. You'll get better. Exhale as you push up. And stop. Bring it back up. Lunge jumps. 40 seconds here. We're at the top of that pyramid. Ready, go. Big scissor arms. Big lunge. Explode up out of that lunge. Remember, if you can't explode, lunge back, but keep those arms going. If you don't want to bounce, that's okay. Just keep working. Almost there, almost there. And stop. Back down your mat. I forgot to say, if you want to do elbow, elbow, hand, hand, but you can't get on the floor, do them on the wall. You can do it here, right on the wall, just to get your get started doing them. That's fine too. Okay, you go at your own level. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand. Ready? Go. Forty seconds here. Exhale as you push up out of it. Keep the head in alignment with the spine. 
Try not to let it drop here. Keep it up. Keep the belly button up and in tight. Core is working hard. Spread those legs out a little wider to make it a little bit more stable. Or bring them in to make it harder. Or even one on top of the other to make it harder. Keep going almost there. Elbow under the shoulder. And stop, bring it up. 30 seconds. Lunge jumps here. And go, 30 seconds. Big scissor arms. Keep breathing, try not to hold your breath. Working our way down that pyramid now. 10 more seconds here. And stop, back down, elbow, elbow, hand, hand here. And go, 30 seconds. Exhale as you push up. Keep going. You need to keep working through the doorbell. That's good. Don't let it stop you, don't let anything Take you away from this. Keep working. This is your time. Don't let anybody ruin it. And stop. Back up. 20 seconds. Lunge jumps here. Go. Really work hard. We're working our way down almost to the end. And stop to your mat, elbow, elbow, hand, hand here. 20 seconds, go. Keep those elbows right under the shoulders. Press up. Remember, you can do those on your knees if you need to, if you're getting too tired. But keep working, don't stop. And stop now. Last 10 seconds, lunge jumps here. Go, last 10 seconds. And stop, back to the floor, last 10 seconds. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand, get a couple good ones in. Ready, go. Go faster if you can, keep the core tight. And stop. Good job, stretch it back. Bring it up, big deep breath in. Take one minute, pause your video, grab a quick drink, towel off, and join me back when you can. All right, we're ready for round three in this workout. This is the pyramid workout. Remember, two exercises, working our way up and down that pyramid. Next two exercises, First one is speed skater, which is a side-to-side -side motion. You're going to land on one leg and push your body weight over to that one leg. So you're really focusing on that quad, glute, strong, stay in that lunge. Try not to stay up here and do it, but get down low and do it, okay? The lower the better, the lower those legs are starting to work. Next exercise would be a squat with a front kick. So you're just going to squat here, sitting back in the heels, come up, you're going to bring your knee up first, this starts the kick, and then you're going to kick throughout the heel, like you're kicking a door in with your heel, and back down into that squat, then the other leg comes up and kicks out, okay? So squats with the kick next. Start with 10 seconds, speed skater, ready, and go. Ten seconds here. Push hard. It's really good. Side to side movement. And stop. Squats with a front kick. Ready. Ten seconds. Go. 
Exhale as you kick. Really sit back in your heels as you squat. And stop. Back to speed skater. Side to side, 20 seconds. Go. We don't do a lot of side to side moving. It's really good for your body. Change it up. Core works hard. Legs work hard in a direction you don't normally go. Really pump those arms out. And stop. Back to squats with a kick. Ready? Go. Now if you want, you can add an alternating punch with that kick. Exhale. As you punch and kick. If not, just keep those arms up. Or if your heart rate's too high, support your hands on your waist. And do it here. And stop. Next one, our next 30 seconds. Speed skater. Go. 30 seconds here. Work hard. If you don't want to jump, tapping side to side is fine. Keep those arms up and out. It's fine. Keep working. Just keep moving. I just ask you never stop moving. Just always stay moving. Can't do the exercise. Do something similar as best you can. Stop here. Squats with a kick. Optional punch. Ready, go. Sit back in your heels as you squat. Exhale as you come up and you kick out through the mouth. If you can't do these, just squat and come up as much as you can. Do what you can and stop. Back to speed skater, side to side. 40 seconds here. 40 seconds. You can go faster if you want. Really work hard. Push those arms out, getting that momentum each side to side. We can go slower. Take that little break in between if you want. It's up to you, just go at your own pace. But push your body. It's okay to be uncomfortable. That's what this is for. You're not supposed to be feeling really happy and good right now. It's supposed to hurt in a good way. Keep working, keep working. And stop. Back to squats with a front kick. 40 seconds, go. Keep pushing. Sit back in those heels. Toes up as you squat. Keep your head up, chin up. Almost there, almost there. And stop. Back to side to side. Speed skater here, 30 seconds. Ready, go. Push this to the best of your ability. Get that heart rate up during these. It's what we want. Healthy heart, right here. And stop. Squats with a kick. 30 seconds. Go. Exhale. As you kick, sit back in your heels as you squat. Really be strong with this. Don't flail. Make a muscle, ha! Kick something, ha! And stop. 
Back to speed skater, 20 seconds. Go. It's only 20 seconds. You can do it. Push your body. Keep going, keep breathing. Stop. Squats with a kick, 20 seconds. Go. Be strong with this, ha. Ha, be strong. And stop. 10 seconds, speed skater, last time speed skater. Go here. Last 10 seconds, speed skater. Go fast, go hard. And stop. Last 10 seconds, squats with a kick. Go. And stop. Good job. Take a breather. One minute, no more. Grab a quick drink, towel off. Join me for the last round. Go. All right, we're ready for round four. Last round in this workout. 10 seconds to start. Work our way up to 40, back down to 10. You guys can do this. First exercise, everyone's favorites. Burpees, you could guess. I can't do a workout without them in there. Gotta do burpees. These are special though. These are 180 degree burpees. So you're gonna do a regular burpee, and then when you come up, you're gonna rotate 180 degrees and do another burpee, then rotate back and do another burpee, okay? I'll show you, right here, it's a burpee, up and rotate, another burpee, up and rotate. Now, if the rotating makes you too dizzy or you can't do it, don't do it. Just do a regular burpee, up, regular burpee. You're still gonna get a great workout in, okay? After the burpees, we're gonna go down for a plank. Actually, to a bridge, what I like to call a bridge, which is elbows under the shoulders. Everything straight, and we're gonna do knee taps here. So you're gonna tap the knees, keeping the belly button up and in. Just kinda run those knees. Remember to keep everything straight and strong here. Okay, if you can't tap the knees, just hold the bridge. All right? You guys ready? It's our last round. You can do this. Starting with 180 degree burpees. 10 seconds. Ready, go. 180 degree burpees, right here. Exhale as you jump up. Rotate in the air. And stop. Down to that bridge. Knee taps. And 10 seconds here, go. Tap those knees. You cannot tap, just hold the bridge here. If you need to go to the knees to hold the bridge, you can do that also. Stop there, bring it up. 180 degree burpees. Ready, 20 seconds, go. And you wanna make sure you're rotating to the same direction. So I'm rotating to the right, and then to the left, so I'm always going this way. That way I work my core evenly. And stop, back down for that bridge. Knee taps here, get in bridge position. Nice, straight and strong, and go, 20 seconds. Keep the belly button up and in, head in alignment with the spine, elbows under the shoulders. Keep working. And stop. Bring it back up. 30 seconds. 180 degree burpees. Ready? Go. 30 seconds here. Just stay here, 
And do it straight up with a regular burpee. If you can't jump, raise those arms up. That's fine. Come back. If going back hurts, just do one leg back at a time and back up. And stop. Back down for plank. Knee taps here. And go. 30 seconds. Tap those knees. Pull the belly button up towards the spine. Hold your rib cage tight together. Keep breathing. Try not to hold the breath. Keep going here. These are hard. If you need to just hold, that's fine. Keep good at the knees, that's fine. Just keep working. Don't ever give up. Only got five more seconds here. Keep working, keep working. And stop. Bring it back up. 40 seconds. 180 degree burpees here. Ready, go. 40 seconds. Exhale as you jump. Our longest part right here. You can do it. Try to explode up from that squatted position. Try not to stand up first and then jump. It's kind of cheating. And stop. Back to that bridge. Knee taps here. 40 seconds. Ready? And go. 40 seconds here. This will be the long one. That's okay, we can do it. Work hard, work hard. When you take a break, you can. But go right back in when you can. Keep working. 40 seconds. And stop to the floor. Last 10 seconds of your workout right here. 
job. Sit up, take a breath, in through the nose, out through the mouth, and bring it down here. Bring those arms around and sit, exhaling, relax the body. Rotate the head side to side, exhale and relax. And release, come back up, come to hands and knees, and arch that back up. Head down, tailbone down, pull the belly button up towards the spine, and reverse it. Tailbone up, head up, exhale. Curl those toes under, and push the tailbone up, walking the hands to the toes. And roll up slowly, one vertebrae at a time. Head comes up last. Exhale big. Big shoulder rolls back. Open up the chest. Look at sweat running down my eyes. And open up those arms, open up the chest big. And close it big, give yourself a big hug here. Release. Bring those arms over the head. So the right arm goes up over the head, fingertips go straight down the back, gently press on that elbow. Inhale and exhale, other arm, fingers straight down the back, gently press on that elbow. And exhale, another great big deep breath in here. Inhale and exhale. You guys are done. Great job with that workout. If it seemed really, really hard for you, do a couple different ones and then come back to this one. Do it again. See how you felt after you have a couple other ones in you. It's gonna get easier for you personally. You're gonna get stronger. The workout's still just as hard, but you're gonna get stronger, okay? So don't get discouraged if it was too hard, if you had to modify a lot. Next time, you'll modify a little bit less. It's okay, keep working, that's all I ask. Great job, have someone in your family or one of your friends give you a high five because you did a great job, something good for yourself today. Uh, make sure to come back next week, I'll have a new video. See you then, bye. As a personal trainer and group fitness instructor, I refer all of my clients to use Zingular nutritional supplements to enhance their exercise program. To learn more, Watch the short video at crazyforzing.com or contact me on my Facebook page, Healthy Body, Happy Life at facebook.com slash hbodyhlife.